Hello everyone, my name is Mark Kramer and I'm Professor of Clarinet at Tennessee Tech University and this video is the second of three installments geared towards helping out beginners get set up on the clarinet. In this video, I'll be talking about proper posture, breathing, and hand position. So let's get started with posture. It's really important to have your feet square and flat on the ground, back nice and flat and shoulders relaxed. A lot of beginners actually like to start kind of hunched over and sitting on their tailbone. And this is not optimal because it kind of crunches your body and it doesn't allow you to take in a full deep breath. So make sure you're sitting on the actual bottom of your pelvis on your sits bones, they like to call in yoga class, and have your back nice and flat and just be completely relaxed and that's a great posture. Next, we're gonna talk about breathing. And I don't like to overly complicate breathing. I'd like to think of it in three different steps. So the first one is you're gonna take your hands and put them right underneath your ribs, right above your hips. And you're gonna take in a deep breath and try to expand your hands out this way. So let's do it together. Take a breath in and out. The next step is I want you to focus on your chest. So think about all the expansion. You're gonna expand out this way, forward and backwards, diagonally, and get a nice full upper breath. So taking a deep breath and out. And the third step is I like to combine steps one and two. So put those hands back under, underneath those ribs and you're gonna start by taking a breath in and expanding out and then continue that breath by expanding up. So breathe in and up and out. Let's do one more. So in and out. So that's your basic breathing. Now, different teachers have different ways of approaching it. I like to keep it very simple at first, and then as a student becomes more advanced, we get a little bit more intricate with those steps. And the last part of this video is I'm gonna talk about proper hand position. And a good place to start is by putting your hands on either side of your body and let them just dangle on the side there, be completely relaxed. Look down at your right hand and you'll see that your right hand has a really nice curvature and this is perfect right hand clarinet position. So grab your instrument and you're going to place your thumb on the thumb rest right in between your nail bed and this first joint here. Now it's gonna be different per individual, but it's a good rule of thumb, haha, <laughs> get it? That you're gonna put the thumb rest in that position keeping that nice curvature that you had when you were relaxed, put those fingers down on the rings of the clarinet and you want the thick kind of gushy, mushy part of your finger pads to go right in those holes just so you get a really proper seal. And another good rule to go by is look at your knuckles and you'll see that your knuckles are gonna be about parallel to the body of the clarinet and that's proper right hand position. Next, we're gonna do left hand. So drop that hand and bring it up and place your thumb and one, two, and three on the clarinet. And I believe that you should have your left hand a little bit more angled than your right. And the reason for that is so that you have access to these keys right here that I'm pressing, the A key and the G sharp key. So in order to get more angle, you're gonna to have to angle your thumb like so at about a 45 degree angle and your knuckles are gonna go out about 45 degrees from the clarinet. Now you'll see that your left ring finger is gonna be a little bit flatter and that's okay. And that's proper left hand position. So to recap, keep that left hand nice and angled, but a nice curvature. The third finger is gonna be a little bit more flat and the right hand is gonna have that nice curvature and a little bit more parallel knuckle. So that is proper hand position on the clarinet. I hope you find this video useful and stay tuned for video three in this series. Good luck and happy practicing.